Yeah, I got a delivery here. Is anyone home? I got a got a delivery for a bunch of fucking losers. Oh, there you are. Remember the simpler days Oberon was regarded as the frame that needed a rework just because he was kinda replaceable in every way due to having little to nothing of his own special flavor to bring to the table? I do. Those days have since passed, and many things have come and gone. Much like an abused 8-year-old child that has been left in a closet, Nyx and Wakon have remained pretty much neglected. While I personally don't care if Wakon doesn't get rework, I demand that he at least get renamed to something much more accurate. Now we live in an age where raids have been given the old yeller treatment, the most delayed Warframe of all time turned out to be about as useful as pre-rework limbo, and now Saren is up for another rework. Somehow. When I heard another frame was getting reworked, I instantly thought of Titania, Nyx, or possibly even Mag for the sake of memes. Imagine my response when I learned that the frame in question was none of those aforementioned war frames, but Saren. Somehow. God forbid that monkey boy gets a rework, oh no. Even though Saren got reworked two years ago and she's not exactly bottom of the barrel in terms of viability, she needs a rework. Somehow. Honestly, I'm not even mad that Voban's still not been mentioned outside of a deluxe skin. Not even close. I'm pissed over DE's decision of rather than attempting to change up the meta by picking up a rather unfavored frame and reworking it to being better or bringing something new to Warframe, all of that is thrown out the window in favor of giving the Rule 34 Warframe some bigger damage potential and numbers to go along with her tits. I don't know what to expect anymore. I want to say that I'm just mildly put off by DE's decision and move about my day and that nothing matters in the end because at the end of it all memes are a core value of the community, so to merely imply that I'm not having fun and hate DE in any way, shape, or form makes me nothing more than a hater. Maybe that's true in a way. I'm too jaded by now from years of logging in, doing my dailies, logging out, and adding another tally mark to the day since Voban was mentioned for a rework counter to care if other people call me an entitled asshole. From my understanding, here's what's going to happen over the course of the next year at least. Umbra and the next cinematic will be released. Limbo Prime, Chroma Prime, Mesa Prime, and Equinox Prime will be released. At least one other frame besides Saren will be reworked, probably Chroma or some other popular pick like Nova. Universal Vacuum will still not be a thing. Focus will be a big deal yet again in Venus Open World. Raids will still be dead, and Archwing will still be relatively left to wallow in its stagnant pool of indifference. By the time most if not all of that happens, I will reach legal drinking age in Japan, and by the time I do, I won't be surprised to learn that nothing has come of Voban besides bug fixes and a deluxe skin, at which point I will drink and wonder why I play when the only frame I quite literally never get bored of using does not garner much interest if any at all from DE only to pass out and do it all over again the next day. Non-meta shit doesn't get touched for obvious reasons, but for Warframes, it's cause for them to linger on as shells of mediocrity. Playing a Warframe that isn't considered meta by everyone else can be described as follows. I'm going to step away from Warframe for a month or two until I regain some semblance of why do I keep my hopes up anymore. Maybe it's just me demanding too much out of DE. How dare I ask for a single frame to be put on the list if we are actively looking into updating this content. Shame on me. Maybe indeed, shame on me, but shame on DE for thinking that Universal Vacuum is not something that players want. In the meantime, my entire opinion regarding updating Voban can be put very simply. I expect nothing, and I'm still let down. Thank you for watching. I'll see you later.